guys, I got a quick grocery haul for you and then I'm gonna tell you why my house is in shambles. Okay, that probably looks funny. All right, so quick grocery haul. You're not gonna see me put anything away because, I mean, my house is a mess, so. <laughs> I just went to Sam's. I'll show you this first. Whew, I'm out of breath, kinda. So I got some Clorox wipes because I only had one unopened container left. Um, I got some Febreze spray because this stuff is amazing. And I need some more. Dawn Power Wash because this is my best friend. Especially when not using a dishwasher, this is my dishwasher. Believe it or not, you have no idea, you need to get some. Um, I got some Gatorade because I opened the other pack and so I want one that's not opened these really cute plates because they're cute I mean how could you not seriously I, I just don't know I have no words how could you not buy these they're adorable and then um, some Swiffer wet mopping clogs these are for quick mopping sessions I really 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 love these and Sam's Club had a pretty good deal on them so and they do smell good okay up here I got I have to hurry because I have to get this in the trash um, the container not the chicken <laughs> I got four chicken thighs bone in because chicken the boneless chicken thighs were astronomical in price oh my stars you would not believe it was crazy I mean of course you'd believe but <laughs> I got some pork chops these are actually our favorite they're born in bone in pork chops these are bone in um, I don't know what that says, assorted pork chops, and um, these are so good. Underneath, there's like some big ones, like really big ones. Got some salted butter. I needed some butter, and I'm hoping that this doesn't look funny on camera. Oh my goodness, I don't know how this is coming out filming. Let's go back to the chicken real quick, just so you can see. Just got those chicken thighs. Okay, and then I got some lemons, because I needed them. We got some sour cream. Sorry, we stopped, left off on the sour cream. I got a big thing of Mexican cheese that I'm gonna divide into two. Um, Cause I've been using a lot of cheese lately so I figured the big thing will be good for me this time. Got some romaine hearts, some chobani, some uh, Dawn Platinum dish uh, stuff. A, I didn't buy this lunch pail, but a lunch pail I need to put away, geez kids. And then some red onions. So now, a really quick overview of my, well, that's just dishes I need to put away, but in Shambles House because surprise video coming up, pantry, oh, I turned you sideways, pantry, oh yeah, wait till you see what we're going to do. I'm leaving it dark in there, I'm not going to show you. I don't know when we're going to be done, so I don't know when that video is going to be up, so I don't know how many, like, I'm not going to be doing, like, cleaning videos or anything. I might just be putting out some recipe videos. I've got one coming out today, um, but I just wanted to give you guys a little uh, update on what's going to be happening in our house, and I wanted to give you this little grocery haul because I needed some stuff again, so, ah, my life. All right, bye, guys. Before I upload this video, I wanted to show you guys what I was doing. Um, I cleaned out some of these jars and uh, rotated some stuff in the pantry, like, put some of the little stuff that was in those jars I had two of, I put them in those, the bigger ones. So I cleaned those out. Oh, this, these two are already cleaned. And I kind of organized them about, I didn't organize this yet. I still need to organize these little ones how I want them in the new pantry. But um, this, let me move this spaghetti one over for you guys. Now, my new, new, new pantry isn't gonna be for a while, okay guys? But what we're doing to this pantry, I'm gonna do it a little bit differently for now until we get my brand new pantry that I'm gonna be doing. I'm so excited. Um, or my husband's gonna be doing. But uh, I got all these organized, and these are one of everything. So literally I've got like one of this, one of this, one of this, one type of bean. Um, so I organized it into each jars of one of regular rice or boreal, Arborio rice, this like rice that looks like a noodle that I forget what it's called. Um, wild rice is back there. So I got it all organized to one is everything. This is the, the, the little jars are the only ones I need to organize still. Um, so all of this is gonna go into the pantry. I actually used one of these for, cause I have a lot of spaghetti in these too. So I used one of these for uh, some of the crackers too. Um, but these jars are already clean. So I have an idea for them, um, but those ones are drying. And so I wanted to show you what I did. That's my kid's candy. Okay, so down here for now until, you know, cause like I said, surprise coming um, for me. Uh, for now, I put all of my extra pastas behind here. You remember how I had those big ones back here? So well, those big, big ones, the refillable ones are still back there, but then I put my other, um, 
little jars of pasta. And these are the ones that are repeats of pasta. So I have like a bunch of shells. I have a, a bunch of those twirly ones. And so these are like the extra pastas, the repeats. And the stuff up front is um, the stuff I'm gonna use in here. And they're they're not the same, they're all different. And then the, like I said, the stuff in the back is different, so. And then it's still the same in this pantry, except for the only thing, like I said, it's still the same up front, um, but the only thing that's different is I put all the extra stuff in the back. I said that like four times, but I just wanna, you know, let you guys know. I, I think it's like three or two jars deep back here because I've got some other, I got some like mixer uh, attachments back there too, so. And then over here, and that's just, uh, rice pasta and beans and then over here I put the extra um, oatmeal and I think I'm just gonna keep it this way but who knows I put the extra oatmeal I put the extra mashed potatoes for baking um, I put the extra powdered sugar and the extra sugar and I still have my big containers way in the back it's just that I put my little ones in here and then I put my popcorn right there because it doesn't fit like that like this. Um, now, um, so this is all the same. I need to figure out somewhere to put this butter because that looks not cute. Um, so I kind of need to fix this again and make it look cute uh, the way that it was before. But for now, because we're doing the renovation, I wanted to put the stuff in here. Like I said, I might keep it in here because it makes it easy for me to rotate it. And the little jars actually makes it easier. Those big jars take up a lot of space. And so the little jars makes me be able to fit a lot more. I know it sounds weird, but trust me, there's a method to my madness. <laughs> so over here, so my husband was complaining that he couldn't put his hands in these jars. So right now, I decided that I wanted to fix it up a little bit. And so I took those jars and rotated the pasta into those ones and well i mean the the extras that are underneath the cabinet i just showed you and uh, i put my snacks in these round ones because he these are big enough for him to stick his hand into and the kids um these are just a little bit thinner of a glass so i'm going to tell the kids to be a little bit more careful but i mean they really are careful so and um and so this is kind of how i organized it um i did three over here with those two in the back and then i did the three little thingies that's just extra nuts right there um, and then I did my little candy jar thing with my Nutri-Grain and raisins. And then there's my other three little jars. And then I put the two back here. And then my three up here. So I think that that looks really beautiful and like, you know, eye-pleasing. I'll sit, I'll uh, go back a little bit when I'm done and show you what it looks like from far away. But then I still kept the basket there. And then I've got my cereal, and I have another idea for what I wanna do with my extra cereal instead of putting it in a bunch of jars. I have an idea, but for now I got my cereal here. And then I have the extra Gatorade back there, the powder, and then my candy jar and my fun granola bar section. There's some healthy ones in there too. And then um, I got my other cereal, so they can choose either one, because I have two cereal containers, and then my tortillas. So let me sit back and I'll show you guys what it looks like from here. It looks really, 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 really cute, and I really like it. And it's super functional. Like I said, my, hand, my husband can just stick his hand in those drawers without a problem, and well, maybe, I don't know, but he's got big hands, but... <laughs> But um, it just looks, it looks super cute. And that's what I go for. I want it to be aesthetically pleasing. So I like, I'm liking it a lot. And so that's how I'm gonna keep this for now. Um, now these little jars, I mean, this is always changing what kind of snacks we have in here. So it's always gonna change. But for now, this is how I'm gonna keep it. Um, this jar is not gonna stay and this jar is not gonna stay except for I opened those almonds. I told you guys I wasn't gonna open because I couldn't help myself and they were so good. But once these um, nuts are used up, then I can rotate these jars and use them for something else. So that's the fun thing about having jars too. You, you can always be redoing your kitchen for fun, so. And then this is an overview of this cabinet with a few things I need to, I of course need to fix those two things right there, but super aesthetically pleasing and looking cute. And then right here. All right, guys, so check, look out, keep an eye out for the video coming of our makeover. And I can't wait for you guys to see it. And I can't wait to use it. And I can't wait for the future for my brand new pantry. It's going to be so awesome. 
hint, it might take that wall up. You just never know. But yeah, hope you guys like this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.